My name is Ben Weiss. Andrea Klempe. <laughs> Mrs. Vavakwa. Robert Christopher Jennings Jr. Gabby. Michael Factor. Grace Mangapura. Zachary Russo. Mike Strohecker. <laughs> Lindsay Davis. How old are you? I am 18 years old. 15. <laughs> 16. I am 17. 15. 51. <laughs> 17. 15. 42. 33. Two. Do you think that you are beautiful? Yes. Do you think that you are beautiful? Yes, I do. I guess, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Physically? <laughs> no. Why not? No, I don't. I think I'm idiots. Yes. I don't think so. Depends. Not really. Certain aspects, I guess. Um, I don't know. I like who I am. I wanted to be a smarty and just say yes, look at me. So much of the way we perceive the definition of beauty is on the outside. I know that I bear the image of God and it says we were all made in the image of God. And I could imagine that God is very beautiful, not just physically but spiritually and at a heart level. So because of who I am as a person and because of who God has made me to be, I do believe that I am beautiful. Just like in certain situations, like if I'm having a lot of fun or if I'm with people that I have a lot of fun with. I think that situation is beautiful, I guess. Because, like, I focus more on, like, my mind and, like, academics and stuff. I don't worry about, like, how I look and stuff because, you know, that's really kind of mainstream. It's not really about looks at all. Like, it depends what your perception of beauty is, I guess. With someone else that you think is beautiful. Julius? My husband. My sister. I think you guys are beautiful. I think everyone's beautiful in their own way. I mean, you do need My a wife. Like, why does it matter? My um, mom. I feel like what Sam's in the left room. All my friends are. Mr. Courtney. My wife. My friends. <laughs> do you wear makeup? No. A little bit. Yes. Do, <laughs> do you wear makeup for yourself or for others? I think I started off wearing it for others, um, and then I, I went through a period of time where I didn't wear makeup because um, I felt untrue to myself, and I felt like if I wasn't able to wear it for myself for an artistic aspect and also just to you know feel like I'm slaying, <laughs> then I shouldn't wear it at all because if I'm just wearing it because I'm insecure, you know, my insecurities will come out at some point and I can't hide behind makeup forever. So I'm comfortable with or without it, but I, um, I do wear makeup now for myself. So? Why? Because I have like no eyelashes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, definitely for yourself. We should never do something for other people when it comes to this topic. And uh, no matter the circumstances, you know, what society thinks, what people think, uh, to just be themselves and, and, and love themselves. I know for myself. Why? To look younger. Um, more for myself. For myself, I think it would be fun to try it, but I would never like think that I have to wear makeup for a specific person. I mean, you do what, do what you feel is comfortable. What what makes you feel comfortable? I mean, I I am I'm in favor of makeup. I vote yes for makeup. What is your view on makeup? I mean, you got makeup, honestly. Like, I feel like that's just something that people use to make themselves feel better. You don't, no one actually, like, needs it. Like, you are who you are and you should be fine with that. I think it's just personal opinion. If they use makeup to feel better about themselves, then that's perfectly fine. I think it's their decision if they want to. I mean, it's not my place to tell them if they should or should not. I don't think it, like, defines them as a person or, like, what their beauty is. I, I personally don't, like, care what makeup someone wears or if they wear makeup at all. What do you think the definition of beauty is? Uh, I think beauty is finding what makes you happy, what's like worth living for. The inside of a person, not physical. Uh, it's, it's curious, somebody who likes to like learn about the world, somebody who likes to experience the world, somebody who is, um, I guess, maybe not necessarily like totally confident but at least like knows has some sense of their him or herself and what they want or at least they're trying to figure out what they want this sounds so cliche uh, <laughs> it's from the heart but it really is because you could be drop-dead gorgeous and have an ugly heart and it doesn't mean a thing when you have faith and the spirit of God is in you people see that in you and people can see 
whether they believe or not, they can see God in other people. And it makes you undeniably beautiful. To enjoy yourself or to be happy with yourself. I think beauty is just what you think of yourself, like, because it doesn't really matter what people think, other people think of you. It's gonna sound really sappy, but I think it's like, what's on the inside that counts. Like, it doesn't matter what you look like, as long as you're a nice person and like, actually treat other people and like, treat them like you think they're beautiful, uh, I think that's what true beauty is. To have like, beauty inside and out, not necessarily like your, um, your external beauty, but like, the kind of person you are and how you're, how nice you are to others. And, I'm now 42 years old and I look at the gray hair and the scars and the life experiences and the failures and the hurts in my life and because of the wild and crazy beautiful ride 